A long, long time ago, two dinosaurs were boxing on the edge of a river. Suddenly, one of them was hit so hard that he fell over and died. Over time, sediments moving downstream covered the fallen dinosaur until he was completely buried. While buried, the dinosaur's flesh slowly decomposed, leaving only bones. As the mineral-rich sediments from the river flowed over the buried dinosaur bones, some minerals seeped through the sediments and filled in pore spaces within the dinosaur's bones. This process is known as permineralization. The burial of the dinosaur bones, along with permineralization, allowed for the bones to be further protected from the environment. As years passed, multiple sedimentary beds built upon the dinosaur, covering his body further and preserving the bones permanently. Millions of years later, a few paleontologists were taking a stroll and sensed that there may be dinosaurs below. Using some of their fossil hunting equipment, they began digging. After a strenuous dig, they came upon dinosaur bones. Since the fossilization process requires such specific conditions, parts of the dinosaur were not preserved. The paleontologists were excited, however, to find all that they did.